Wow. How do you like that? That was a bad plan. All right, we are back with some more Echoes of Wisdom, and we are going into a volcano. We've got Gorons we need to rescue. Oh dear. Great. 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 Our favorite Goron is back. How can you help? Um, how about, how about you stay out of our way? That'd be a great plan. Look, even Try knows the deal here. <laughs> just, just stay back, buddy. All right, it's dungeon time. I'm excited for a dungeon. We had a whole episode last time with zero dungeon. And we're gonna dive in. I'm hoping, now that we're in the second half of the game, we're gonna pick up on our um, complexity. First, you weren't that uh, complex. And I'm gonna say less complex even than the um, like a link to the past dungeon. All right. Uh, what do we got here? We're in a volcano. Oh right, we're still inside the actual rift. The rift section. That's fine. Okay, so we'll make our way across the lava. The, the, we're not gonna try and make that jump because we have beds. Bed. Ah! Oh my gosh. My aim. There we go. Bed. Okay. Um. You. Get him. Good job. Got him. Um. Now we actually have one of those lava octoroks, right? Here, so get them. Do your thing over there. Oh wait, I can't. Okay, so I can't put one of the big rocks down now because I have a two out there. But a bed, a bed should be fine. You can do a bed. Wow, this is riveting. But uh, I think we can do better. See. Aha! Got him. Alright, so I see like these big sort of blob things. Here's here's another question that occurs to me. Water. Is water gonna do anything for me? Nope, game just says no. Water does nothing. Zavata does nothing! Um, I think we're just gonna go over there, because why wouldn't we? There's a treasure chest after all. Bam. Got some rock tatoes. Delicious. Yeah, that felt like a shortcut. Um, is our trampoline good enough? See, I want a level 2 trampoline. That's what I want. Bam. And here's a Goron that needs rescued. Great. Super. I guess time is frozen in here? Is that what I'm getting? I don't think I quite picked up on that before. Time has been frozen. You hate it when that happens. Um, I don't see an easy way to get across that, so... We'll go this way. Actually, we'll go up here this way, because there's a stairway here. That makes sense, right? And... Da -ba -ba -ba. Wow! That didn't work. <laughs> you gotta jump. What? I jumped. I promise I jumped. Um, wait, how many is that? That's three. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna jump on a table. We're gonna jump on a table. There we go. Now we're a little higher. That should be high enough, right? Let's go. Oh my goodness. This is, it's a struggle. Can I really not just jump off? There we go. All right, we're just doing it poorly. And magic tile. Purple rupee, okay. Can't help but feel like I'm not going the right way. Yeah. Seems like a no. We need, we need to go up there. The question is, how do we get up there? What will be the best way to do so? Like, can I just... It's... 
You know, our depth perception here is not ideal, I will say. But I don't see any particular reason I can't just jump up here, right? Okay, just to make life easier. Ow. Oh, we broke our bed. Oh my gosh, we're doing so good. That was, this is all according to plan. Here we go. We're climbing. Look at us climb. We're gonna climb this way, actually. <laughs> Aha! A thing. A checkpoint. Checkpoints are good. Oh, there's even a map. Look at that. Looks like we're going to the left. I can handle left. Uh, where's our attack mafula? I love the idea that we have this little mafula on our team, because every other time mafula has showed up, he's been a boss. And in Link to the Past, he was a pretty intimidating one in a room full of spikes. But, uh, no, nope, we're, we're good here. We're just tiny little mopulas. All right, great. Let's go. Uh, looks like we're going to need a keys. Keys, buddy, let's go. Whoop. And we're flying. Let's go. There seem to be some other bullshit happening over there. We're just going to ignore all that. And move on with our life. Um, fly. Okay, I'm here, and I'm not exactly sure how that helps me. But I think there's a platform down there, right? That seems like a platform, right? Perfect. And indeed, I think we may have even found our temple. So let's get in there. That rock was, that was just a hole in the middle of nothing. Ooh, it's a hot spring. Perfect. Please do not tell me that I just found a temple. What is this? Okay, great. I'm so so happy for you. So happy we're close to your friends. Hit our checkpoint. Right, technically, technically, this is the Elden Temple. Kind of stuck to using these terms for different areas of Hyrule. Trying to remember when that first happened. I want to say Skyward Sword. I think Skyward Sword was the first time to name that. Elden and Lanieru. Obviously named after the uh, goddesses. Okay. What do I have that can deal with these guys? I have a dark nut. Because of the fire. Oh my gosh, they still burn! How do you still burn? You've got armor on! Wow, what else do we got? That's the question. The real question. How about you? Can you, do, can you do anything? Not if I put you right in fire, I guess. Uh, you jump? Anything, literally. That's the question. What is our best, like, what, what about this guy? Will you still attack? Attack. Attack. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. I should not have believed in him. Um. Huh. This is a tricky one. I'm trying to think what other fire related enemy. You know what? I do just have fire keys, right? Maybe for the moment we'll go with the easy answer. Here you go, fire keys. Get him! Aha! Very nice. I don't necessarily know that this is an important fight for me to win, but. Ah. I suppose, at the very least, we'll find out if there's a key. Oh my gosh, with the dodge. Come here. Fire to you. Alright, we just took all the damage there trying to kill one bat. So, um... Going great in this dungeon. Alright, what do we got? I uh, see. Hey, here's something that didn't occur to me before for no good reason. I can move that. Great. Spectacular. Okay. I have a thought. I have a thought. We're gonna try something. We're gonna try and be clever. Let's see how we do. First of all, you're gonna go there. And 
we're gonna play it safe. We're gonna grab ourselves a bed. Sort of hop up here. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this, nope, not the dark knife, this rock. Over there. All right. Not quite done. That was that was step one of the plan. Ah. Ow. Okay. It was a good plan, poorly executed. Like so many plans. Like, I think there's another way to do this, but I want to make this work. Ha! Magic! Bam. Feel good about that one. Oh, okay. We're just gonna do more of this, huh? I mean, they've really committed to your creatures being the way you do things, or your echoes, I suppose. But maybe just having a button for a glider wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. I don't think I would have thrown a fit if that had been what they had done. Key? Key! I'll take it. I have to say, overall in this game, most of our uh, dungeons have been less the traditional puzzle block kind of dungeon and more like a series of challenges for you to test your ability to use echoes. Which, in a sense, does make sense, but is maybe not what I am most looking for. Okay. You're just gonna give me rocks, we're gonna use rocks. Not very well, apparently. Alright, alright, alright. Clearly, that was not working. Eat them off. Do it. They played a treasure chest, so that's good. Ow. Just gonna let ourselves get bombed, apparently. <sighs> just attacks again. Like, we could wait, but, you know, you summon another one, they just attack. I mean, that is the, the thought, although it didn't happen that time, for sure. Alright, there's our secret treasure chest. What's in here? It's a twisted pumpkin. What makes a pumpkin twisted? Can I make tea out of it? All right, we're gonna pop down here because we can and check out this hot spring for just a moment. Just the barest of moments. This game is really short on um, recovery hearts. I know there is an accessory you put on that lets you get them faster, but I much prefer the higher jump seems more useful. Oh. Um. Okay. I see. I almost like I don't actually want to go over there because there's nowhere to go over there. Okay, that was close. Wasn't sure I was gonna make that. Um, I might need to beat this guy up, huh? <laughs> um, I'm gonna say touching that treasure chest might not be our best plan in real life because <laughs> it's in lava right now. But, you know, we may do, huh? No golden egg. You know what? We gotta beat all these guys up, don't we? That's the, that's the game plan. Um, how about our fire octorox? Here you go, fire octo. Ow. What can you do for us? Um, maybe? You just need fire enemies, right? Aha! Yeah, that guy wasn't doing anything for us. 
Attack. Attack, I say. Alright. Look, they're clearly confused. You can do it. I believe in you, Octo. Yeah, look at that. Get them from both sides. Okay. Perfect. I think. I have a different plan. Let's see if it does literally anything. Uh, it's pretty firmly on the nothing happened side of things. Okay, well we're doing some kind of puzzle, I guess. See if there's anything under this block. What do you got under you? Oops. There. Let's check that out. Aha! A switch, sure enough. Perfect. Uh, yeah, okay, I guess we don't have to hold that button down, which is handy. Because that would have meant figuring out what can hold a button down in the, uh, in the lava. Do it the hard way. Just, just go like that. It's fine. We got basalt. It floats. We're gonna pretend it doesn't get hot. Uh, we're going side scrolling now. You ready? Let's do it. Raising and lowering lava. Is that enough? That's probably enough. Aha! Barely. I don't feel like I learned anything from that puzzle. In a good puzzle, you, like, learn some new technique, or you think about things a way you hadn't before. We're gonna go down first. Does this hurt? It does hurt. Alright. I know, I know, I know. I walked right into it. Felt like I had to check. There we go. What's down here? Lava! Spectacular. Oof. This doesn't look great. It doesn't come up this high though, right? Yeah, so... Actually, we won't go dead this time. We'll go tile. Hmm. Hypothetically, what happens if I drop a rock on you? I miss, first of all. Okay, well that's that's good. I think that worked. Other rocks float? Not for very long. Okay. Noted. The rocks kind of float. Back. And we're gonna use 
our friendly neighborhood lava rock. It's definitely made out of basalt, right? Just the uh, I suppose. There we go. Door open. Man, this dungeon is a pain to navigate. To be clever. That's when I get into trouble, you know? <laughs> you try to get too clever. Aha! Down was correct. Here's a treasure chest with a key. Bingo. Bingo, bango, bongo. Ba, 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 ba. I like these flying tiles. These are fun. Okay. Now we go. say hypothetically put a rock down and then on top of that rock we place this elephant statue oh my gosh it's beautiful love it oh we got a map how about that i don't remember i can stack things you know this is the sword. this connection Stacking things and moving them after could be useful. We're gonna ignore that bat. Can't do anything to me, bat. Aha! You know, that looks suspiciously like a big key door. Mm, I don't have a big key. No, no, regular key. Alright, what do we got now? So many bombs. Are we going to get bombs? Yep, because there's Link. Well, Shadow Link. And he's got bombs. Well, you know what? You know what I say about that. I say... Check out this guy. Where are you going to go? Huh? Ah! Oh my gosh, bomb chews! We got bomb chews too. Well, that's exciting. I'm just gonna sick this guy on you. I mean, maybe. Or maybe he won't attack. That would be too easy, I suppose. Get him! Oh, up there? Up there? You wanna be up there? Fine. I can be up there. Aha! Oh, now he's angry. Oh, you're angry now? Here. Shadow Link. Loser. Beat you up with a lizard. Oh, bombs, huh? Very fancy. I don't think so. Oh, my guy was still down there. No, don't jump away. What are you doing? Attack! Just attack! I know when they were fighting me, they just jumped in there and got the stuff done. Okay, we got bombs. I don't know how helpful that's actually going to be since, you know, we have at least two different forms of bombs. But... Well, we'll see. Alright. Speed up Link for a third time. The bombs of might. Sure. What makes these bombs especially mighty? That's what I want to know. I have a fish that explodes. 
which is pretty cool. Ah. What's over there? Stuff. Stuff is over there. Uh, da -da -da -da. Let's go get the stuff, I guess. on you. Okay, well that, you know, I'm gonna say that didn't go as well as I wanted it to. Fight! There we go. Good job, buddy. Do your thing. Alright, perfect. I guess. Is it perfect? I don't know. Where's our bomb fish? <laughs> Where's our, our good friend, the bomb fish? I forgot we had the gust master. That could be handy. That's the thing, I almost have too many tools sometimes. Oh, look at that, it was a thing of beauty. <laughs> and then I just missed the jump. So good! We're, we're the best at this game. There we go. Yep. Attack him. You're doing great. Oh, the fire keys. I just feel like I don't have a good way to fight the fire keys, so I'm just going to ignore them mostly. See, like, I just... I have bombs. I have bombs. Already. Doesn't seem like a great reward. Like, when you first get the Link form, you get access to a sword, so if you're really in trouble, you can just go ahead and attack directly and not have to bring out a monster friend just to do it. And then the second thing you got was the, um, the arrow, which was also handy, because that's a long-distance attack. Ooh, a silver ruby. Just filled with joy over here. Now, I'm not going to deny that these are annoying bombs, right? They're, they're not great. They're a pain to use, and I, and I think that's what they were going for. Pretty sure that's intentional. Oh, it's a wizard robe. Hi. Um, I think we're just gonna do this, right? This is a good plan. I like this plan. This rope is not very smart. Ah! <laughs> that was so easy. And now we have a whiz robe. Alright, now we have a whiz robe. The fire whiz robe. What's our fire wizard robe look like here? Oh no, I can't even use him! Oh, that's rough. I don't like that at all. Alright, I guess that was our key that we needed downstairs. So, back down we go. I suppose I, in theory, like the idea of them giving us echoes we can't use yet, because it builds anticipation. And perhaps even as soon as the end of this dungeon, we might find a way to make use of that. You, you're just gonna not, right? I don't know why I keep thinking it might work. Hmm. Surely one of you will attack. Right? Just one of you. Man, who can... That's the thing, right? Oh, you, you, you can do this, right? You got this. Attack! That's what we needed. We need the spear bot, the spear moblins. Like, it's not an ideal situation, if we're being honest. But it did work, so there's that. Oh, no, he's over here. Alright, bomb!
just want to put anything down here, really. Ah, there was a key hidden in there as well. I had no idea. That was like an up. We're gonna go down first and see what's down here. Gotta say, I feel kinda cocky having two keys. Uh, where are we? What is going on here? Alright, that was up to the dungeon boss. But we definitely don't have a boss key yet, so... Hmm. I like the rickety ladders, that's a nice touch. Whee! Yeah, that was a leap of faith. You know what? It's been a minute. Oh, they're not gonna go. Okay. Okay. I see how it is. Well, fine. Eat this. I <laughs> like just dropping rocks on them. You know what? The other thing I can do, and I haven't really messed around with this, but I do have my own mini mini mold arms. That's just the whole dungeon, huh? We're gonna have one little uh, section here. Oh, right, I get it. I see what's happening. Time for an escape. Alright, we're escaping. Let's go. Oh, dang. <laughs> dang. Here's my this thing flying tile. So that um, the broken ladder was in fact relevant. Interesting. Okay, guess that was it. And I suppose now we can go to the at least towards the boss room. I'm gonna say it's perhaps not the most complicated dungeon in the world. Here's a question. Can I just, like, hold you there? Yeah, I can. Stay. Okay, see, so, yeah, look, we're, we're getting new techniques. See, what do I even need bombs for, really? It's gonna hurt. Oh, we're not. Alright, perfect. Go. Yeah, this is what I was expecting to see. Although, although, oh, I see. All right, I was trying to figure out what the what the challenge was going to be. So it didn't seem particularly difficult. Okay, there's more. That's good. A fairy jumped into your bottle. He's so happy to be there. I don't trust this game. At least not in that aspect. Okay, we're gonna get attacked by Octorox this time. But you know, that's fun. Just gonna keep moving, that's the trick. Let's go. Here you go. We're here. I'm gonna say, honestly, that dungeon was a little underwhelming. Again, it's not super interconnected. Let's look back at the map real quick. Yeah, it doesn't really even look that big. Because down here we had like this one wing to go to to get a key, so we can go over here, and then an optional room with treasure. And then we had some of this stuff to navigate, and we need to get a key there to go up here. And then we fought our mini-boss, and then it was another, like, get two keys. And the two keys got us to our boss. Yeah! What's-his-face, who does the dungeon diagrams, is gonna have, uh, easy time with, with this. Boss keys? Boss keys. That guy. Oh my. I will say, this boss room looks like there's something going on. Is it Volvegia? 
It is Volvegia! Look at that! Interesting. Well, how about that? See, I'm okay with occasionally calling back previous bosses. This game hasn't even done a lot of it, so especially that. It's, like, it's not that big a deal. Wow, that was fantastic. I am the best at this game. Uh, all right, can we just uh, send you over there? Oh yeah, that did damage. I'm just gonna dodge and do this. I mean, if it works, why not? Ah, attack! Attack my minions! Where's he going? All right, all right. Can can you attack now? You'd be my best friend here if I managed that. I wasn't really expecting them to. Big orb. Like, maybe there was something we could have done with the big orb, but eh. This is working. Aha! Dodged you. You're just not really up to, up to this, are you? Here he goes, he's going down. Where's well, he gonna pop up? Oh, he's over there now. Ow. See, I can't help but feel like I'm missing something at that point of the boss fight. Like, there's probably something I can do with that green orb. Oh no! Suddenly I can't dodge. Damage though. Damage is good. They like damage. Attack the giant um, lava monster. He's a dragon. He's a lava monster. I love when you can trick them into fighting your minions instead of just you. <laughs> Before we get hit, uh, don't we have a fight? Yeah, there we go. Fireproof. Love it. Oh. Well, that's broken. Can't tell if that's good or bad. Now what do we attack? He doesn't have a glowy green bit. That's trouble, right? Oh, he has a new one. He probably did that before and I didn't. Oh no, I can't get close to him now because he's by the fire. What do I do? Oh yeah, good job getting in there. Oh my gosh. So much lava. Ow. Alright, alright. Take another one. Wall climb speed up. Sure. Oh, there's more. <laughs> there's more now. Aha! Okay. He's going over there now. Wait, no, it's going over here. Where are you gonna go? Right in the middle. See, sometimes they attack right away, sometimes they don't. Like, see, that was two in a row that attacked quickly what we need. Get those quick attacks in. A little hard to see those lava deals. Going up. There he goes. I assume we're doing things, right? Seems like we're doing things. We'll, we'll keep doing things. Get in there! Oh, we got multiple giant green, green orbs now. Aha, I jumped it! Aha! 
Okay. I know, I'm just being stubborn now. Like, surely they gave me the bombs for a reason. But, you know, why not use the thing that works, huh? Go. Attack! Attack my minions! Oh no! <laughs> not like that! Blowy orbs. I can't help but feel like I'm missing something here, but, uh... I don't know. I'm not getting a lot of negative feedback, so... Keep doing it! See, sometimes they just don't attack, right? I'm not sure what to make of that, really. Oh boy. Okay. I guess that was fine. Not really a puzzle boss. See, in Zelda, sometimes we have bosses that are just puzzles, right? And other times it's, you know, an actual... Just a fight, you know? Find his pattern, attack, all that jazz. Okay, so I guess we solved that dungeon. And now this is happening. But that means we'll get an upgrade. And maybe there'll be a good upgrade. Yes, I'd want another, uh, another triangle. Another triangle would be good. There's a couple of things I wouldn't mind having reduced cost. I gotta say, I gotta say, that the, um, the volcano's a little less intimidating than in Breath of the Wild, right? Death Mountain is a pretty massive structure. Level five, level six. What do we get? Oh no, the kitty is paying attention. He's ready to pounce on our little, our little dude. Let's get a little shot. See the kitty? All right, so we did get another triangle, which is nice. Triangles are useful. messages on my phone as well. Okay. Oh! It's Din. Interesting. I don't know that we've talked to the goddesses before. Well, that's kind of fun. A boom from the god uh, gods themselves. Din's sanction. Sanction extols your deeds. Oh, it's just going to be an artifact. I thought it was going to be some kind of cool ability, but I guess not this time. Maybe next time. It won't be next time. All right. Fine. This cat is still... Staring at the screen. He is transfixed. Okay. Well, that's a dungeon taken care of. Let's get out of here. One of these things down. Uh, two more to go? Probably two more. And maybe a final dungeon? Unclear. Unclear how long this will actually go on. Of course we're incredible. Yes, yes, I'm sure. I am sure everyone will be back safe and sound. Yeah, we'll see how this goes. How much talking are we going to be doing? 
Oh my gosh, look at all the Goron. That's fun. Hip hip hooray indeed. Alright. I guess we rescued the Goron. That's nice. I continue to like the Goron just fine. And uh, maybe this guy will be a little better now. Yep, you stay here. Definitely, definitely important that you stay here. I think we can handle the rest. Okay. That was actually a relatively uh, refreshing amount of dialogue, which is to say a small amount of dialogue. Oh, no, there he goes. Attacking the screen. Don't do it. Alright, well, we're gonna do a quick save, and that'll be, that'll be it for this one. If you're watching on YouTube, hit me with that uh, like and subscribe. It always helps out. And uh, we'll catch some more results next time. Later.